Aliyah and welcome back to Cooking with Aliyah International Edition and today we have a special guest here, my friend Ashi, who's going to show us how to make something very special. Hi, Hi Aliyah. Hi Ashi, I'm so glad you're here. I'm so happy to be here. I'm excited to show you how to make chicken chetinad, which is something that's very dear to my heart. Uh, because it's South Indian food, which is where I'm from. So how do you call it? Chicken? Chetinad. Chetinad. And what does that mean? It's a region in South India really known for its spices. And you can tell just from the smells and beautiful aromas of the food. So um, this chicken seems to be very flavorful. Yes. And I, you get me really scared when there's a lot of things going on. Is it a very difficult dish to make? Absolutely not. People tend to think that Indian food is hard to make. It is not at all and I'll show you how. I'm so excited mm -hmm. about this. I've been to South India and I loved it so much. So yeah, food there is amazing and we're going to learn how to make this dish super easy, right? Woohoo! Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so are you ready? Well, she's really ready. <laughs> so let's start. So the first step is to marinate chicken with yogurt. Awesome. So you just add the yogurt. This is plain yogurt. This is plain yogurt. Whole yogurt, you can use non-fat yogurt, whatever you like. Our next step is to cook the onions. So far that seems easy. Actually, oh, it's really easy. Okay, this is going well. <laughs> I like this dish. <laughs> so on medium heat, add vegetable oil. And I like to perfume the oil with cardamom, cloves, and cinnamon. So let the oil infuse the spices for about 30 seconds until you can smell the aromas. Add the chopped onions to the oil. You hear the sizzle? Just what you want. So you cook the onions for about 15 or 20 minutes while stirring occasionally and make sure that they turn a nice golden brown. So if the onions are sticking to your pot, you may add a little water. And they won't stick anymore. So when your onions are a beautiful golden brown, add freshly grated ginger and freshly crushed garlic. Give it a stir and cook for another five minutes. So after cooking the ginger and garlic for about five minutes, you add chopped tomatoes into the pot along with some fresh green chilies. Add salt, add turmeric powder, red chili powder, and green coriander powder. Lots of coriander powder. Cook this mixture uncovered for 15 minutes on medium heat, stirring from time to time. After 15 minutes of cooking all the ingredients, add the marinated chicken. And cook for another 10 to 15 minutes. So the chicken is ready when the oil separates and if you were to split a chicken piece you can tell that it's white all the way through. You can now add curry leaves if you have them, some freshly ground black pepper, chopped cilantro and a fresh squeeze of lime juice. And you're done. Ashi. The chicken, the chicken, well, the kitchen and the chicken <laughs> smell amazing. This is really, really flavorful. Oh, I can't wait to taste it. What do you uh, serve this dish with? Usually we serve it with steamed basmati rice. Basmati rice, it's really good, right? Okay, so you show us how you serve it in your plate? Sure. If you'd like to get a little fancy, you can fill your cup measure with some rice and pack it in and then turn it over onto the plate. That's a nice trick. Oh man, this smells so good. There we are. Wow, it's just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Such a hole, Alia. Yeah. Yeah. We'll just put it a little bit. I mean, can you have a little more? Fine. Okay, good. Go. <laughs> can I save some for myself? Yeah. <laughs> so that's when I know I have like the luckiest um, hobby in the world, which is tasting the food of other people. And I'm going to taste this for you. Man, this is amazing. I'm going to break this rice. Actually, it's amazing. It is so, it's so flavorful. It's so complex, and then simple at the same time. So you, you're like, you don't know what you're eating, but you're like, oh my god, this is amazing. Oh, it's so clean. I like the clean taste of the flavors, and the chicken is very um, soft. Oh, it's amazing. Thank you, Ashi. Thank you, Anya. This is great. You guys have to try. This is super easy too. Oh yeah. Mm, yum yum. So this is a conversation I had with. Ashi, I was like, okay, so how do you say bon appetit in uh, Indian? Uh, please, Ashi, respond to that. <laughs> we don't have time for bon appetit, just eat. <laughs> so, for today, we just eat it. <laughs> See you next time. <laughs>